Hello YouTube, it is Friday, April 3rd at 8.45 in the morning. Um, yes, just wanted to give a little update on the state of my immediate nation, i.e. Rhode Island, and what's going on with the coronavirus. It's obviously the thing that's on all of our minds right now, and it's affecting all of our lives. Um, so... Uh, Rhode Island was very early in uh, getting cases, and I think we had our first cases around the be very beginning of March. Um, and, you know, like everything with this coronavirus, it, it started with only, like, one or two, and then it's grown since then. So now we have 657 cases and 12 people have died of the coronavirus in Rhode Island. That number has gone up, as is, as is expected, um, but we were very quick on the draw for enacting some measures to to sort of combat this since we had our first cases so early um we were a little later on getting a stay-at-home order new york was before us and connecticut and massachusetts had a stay-at-home advisory ours did finally come into effect on march 28th um they tried to do it on a more sort of advisory basis for a little while and People kept going to the beaches and hanging out, so finally our governor uh, just basically said that's it. Um, so that's sort of what's going on right now. Uh, we are allowed, obviously, to do kind of necessary things, you know, walk the dog, go to the supermarket, um, go to the pharmacies, that sort of thing. But all non-essential businesses are closed. Uh, restaurants are still doing takeout and delivery, which is really important for them right now because Rhode Island has a big restaurant um, industry and hospitality industry, and they're getting kind of killed right now. Um, I think we have the highest rate of unemployment right now in any state. Um, a lot of people are out of work, um, which really sucks and is not good for anyone but uh the good news is is we are going to probably be hitting the top of our curve by around april 24th um that that date keeps changing a little bit and just how high the top of that curve is going to be is sort of the question of the day um so that's sort of what's going on and this 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 coronavirus thing it just it really sucks for everyone. Um, you know, there's nothing really to do except stay at home and, you know, f maybe try to follow the news. Um, maybe don't do that too much. But, yeah, it's it's uh, it's a little scary right now. But we're just we're trying to get through it. Um, we're not as bad as New York or Massachusetts and... The fact that we're sort of sandwiched right in the middle of those two makes us all a little nervous. The one thing you might have heard about that Rhode Island did get a little bit of press for was a previous order by the governor to, as the news put it, hunt down people coming from New York. Uh, there are a lot of sort of second homes in Rhode Island and in South County in the southern part of the state, and there was a concern that people would be leaving from New York to go to those homes and thus to avoid the quarantines and avoid the virus, but also inadvertently, you know, bring the virus to us. Um, but that order is no longer in effect. So the National Guard is not hunting down people from New York. The Rhode Island State Police is not hunting down people from New York. Um, but sort of in its place is a full advisory for every state now if you're coming into rhode island from any state or from overseas you have to self-quarantine for uh 14 days so that's sort of how they've ended that um the governor of new york at one point uh said that he would sue us that hasn't happened 
So I think that's that was the one little misstep that got a little bit of press coverage from Rhode Island. But other than that, things are pretty okay. This is sort of, as of right now, this is the new normal, and it's a weird new normal, but, you know, that's okay. Um, so, yeah, that's what's going on. Our uh, governor, like many governors right now, is holding a press conference every day, holding a briefing. So that's been really interesting to sort of tune into and see what's going on, where we are. Um, yeah, so I think... Th- Yeah, that's what's going on. There's nothing else that new.